And we are back with Narcissu, except now we're gonna go to the second Narcissu, which doesn't make sense to me because Setsumi, spoilers, died. <laughs> so uh, what's that all about? I have no idea. I guess we'll all look in. Hello everyone, I am Sinistic and I am slightly feeling a little bit more better than I did playing the first Narcissu. So not even because of the game made me sad or anything, it's because I'm just <laughs> really overwhelmed and anxious in my own life. So hopefully I can do better <laughs> or hopefully no no, no i don't want to say that I'm, I'm always trying my i want to try my best and i will continue forth because i want to just do more videos all right narcissu 2 what's up oh oh a girl in front of the outpatient reception desk on the fourth floor attached to the floor many colors are plastic tape red blue green they led the way to various departments out of those i followed the white tape Walking about 30 meters on the right, the shop comes into sight. Across from what- across from that was the smoking room. On the left is the waiting room for surgical examination, and if you continue to the end, there's a- there is a small elevator. I get on that, and press the blue- uh, blue button. Press the button for the highest floor. The seventh floor. Before my eyes were the nurses' stations. Altogether, a number of nurses looked this way. But once they recognized me, their eyes turned back, and as if they saw nothing, they returned to their work. High ceilings. Windows that only opened 15 centimeters. This was a white, well-lit sterile place. Okay, so you also- but, uh, like, same with the protagonist on the other game, also notice that the window opens 15 centimeters, but okay. And I head towards the lounge at the end of the hall on the left. A large television, a long couch, decorating the windowsills were a number of flowers. But in the summer, the many sunflowers in the vases and the uh gerbera, gerbera daisies and flower pots were blooming colorfully. Those are all familiar things. How many years has it been since I've come here? What's the difference when? Oh no! What's the difference from then? Where my clothes changed from sailor uniform to uniforms to pajamas. Besides that, the bracelet. Blah. The bracelet on my hand, from blue to white, was just about the only other change. You. Turning back towards the voice that called, it was a middle-aged lady. Her pajamas and bracelet colors said she was a resident of this place. Are you visiting someone, or a patient from another floor? That's not it. While shaking my head, I showed my own bracelet. Ah, I see. The lady replied uncomfortably. About the nuance behind the words, those words. So young. What a shame. Of course, I've had similar experiences. So often be it was tiring. I haven't lived almost ten years like this for nothing. It was just never thought to have a fellow resident of the seventh floor also turn eyes of pity towards me. By the way, which time are you on? What's this? We're here. Coming to the seventh floor. For an instant I had no idea what she was asking. But before I could ask a new question, it looked like this is your first- No, oh, it looks like this is your first. With that, she just up and acted like she understood the situation. Well then, I'll teach you two, so listen carefully, okay? First, in this place called the seventh floor, even though I hadn't replied, the lady just continued speaking. There was no fourth time. The third time you're admitted is the last, so prepare yourself. When you want to run away, head not to station A, but to station B. Don't eat anything. It places the le least burden upon your family. We spoke about such things, and I was made to hear other things that would give one pause. Most likely it was something only the residents of the se of the seventh floor, only those who were headed towards death, continued passing on. So, you understand. Hmm. Once the lady went through her whole explanation, somehow I thought her complexion looked better. <sighs> to tell someone young like you, it's upsetting. And this is also a rule, so don't be angry, okay? With that, the lady left the lounge. Her parting words were, You tell new people too, okay? Burning sunlight and the sound of cicadas. Summer sky seen the, from the windows that can't open more than 15 centimeters. Today also looked like it would be a hot day. Many years since I've come to the 7th floor. First that I've come as a resident of this place. And the rules I had been taught. In practice, they were probably passed down only among those who res resided here. But a number of them, 
I'd already known. Wow, she looks different. Setsumi got an upgrade, anime upgrade, I guess. I'm so used to her like eyelashes being super like thick, <laughs> like from the promo pictures. So this this picture is different. All right, maybe it was since that day, the fact that I would face a day like today. And then Narcissus One happened. Hmm. I should go back and relabel those on my older playthrough. Okay, you're not Setsumi. <laughs> Yikes, oh my god. Please don't let Setsumi be like a young girl and she's like, oh. nope, okay. Okay, JK. Okay, before any picture is released, I'm imagining the one who's talking has like a really short hair, maybe short black hair, and the one who's younger is talking has like twin tails or something. My little sister gave the usual grease stains a sulking look as she complained. It was the scene of a casual, everyday exchange before the door on a Sunday. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not here to listen to the word of God. If you're not gonna go, why show up to the church? <laughs> Baka head, Chihiro. God doesn't exist. Okay, <laughs> okay, joke. <laughs> Oh, she's into cars too, like Satsumi. Himeko? Best friend. Alright. In the garage next to the house, I strongly raise the shutters. Oh my god, those are like tra those clonad transitions. Perhaps because it was closed off, the garage was stifling hot. Immediately, I turned towards my beloved car under maintenance, purchased just a month earlier. Man, this is such a different vibe from first Narcissu. Like, uh, and maybe it's because they don't have a terminal illness that we don't know of yet, but it's just. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's just, I'm taken aback a little bit. One might call it a restoration, but really, it was work to simply get it to run properly. First, instead of calling the classics retro, the word scrap would fit better. Such that was the age and condition of the car. However, thanks to that, I've lately been spending the weekends inside this garage. Himeko! Iru? Ah! Go to go to! What did you do? This place? Yes, I came to the close, but I came to the close. What? You're not a mess. Man, I don't even need a voice act in this right now. Gosh. これがまた大変だったのよ。っていうか、素人でここまでできる人は少ないわね。え、変。いや、パンダかご飯だか知らないけどさ、ほら見て、この自作版がなんて大したもんでしょう。でもやっぱウィンチがないからクロンした。あのさ、姫子、車好きもいいけどさ、年頃の娘が真っ黒になってガレージにリビタってるってどうよ。What do you mean? Okay, maybe this game came out in 2007, but that's not really like bad. もしかして変?もしかしなくても変。まあいいじゃない。Okay, <笑> well, I don't know who just came in, but I'm going to assume she has longer hair and it's like peach color. Okay. She lived nearby and since long ago, we often spend time together. However, our interests and personalities were polar opposites, and yet we got along for some reason. 
might have been exactly because our interests and personalities were different that we got along. Alright, cool. せっかくの初任給をこんなボログルマに使うなんてさ。ほら。ボログルマじゃなくて、ゆうのすって言ってよ。それにこの方って古くても結構人気あるのよ。へえ、そうなの。え、おかげで今から冬のボーナスまでロー
there's no one in the car though. There are literally no bodies in the car. Are you telling me Himeko, Yuka, and little sister are like not even here? At least Setsumi's alive. Like there's literally no one in the car. Who's driving this thing? Okay, I'll move on. Plot twist, we're all on the seventh floor. Like in reality. There's no one in the car. <laughs> what is a roadster? Or is he trying to meme like roadstar? Oh, here we are. Man, it must suck if it rains. じゃないわよ。風で髪がくしゃくしゃになっちゃったでしょ。おばかさんね。オープンの醍醐味がわからないなんて。あ、そんな醍醐味。年頃の女の子に不要よ。Why <笑> <笑><笑> I don't think wind wipes away your makeup though. Your hair, I get that, but I don't think the wind's gonna be like so strong it's gonna slap the lipstick right off your lips, you know? But who am I to say that I've never been in a situation like this? The sun was still high and the Yunos ran under the refreshing cool of a sky before the rainy season. Soon, after leaving the long mountain road, a deep blue sea spread wide. Oh wow, look at that beach! The sea route continued endlessly. From nearby came the crashing of waves and seagull calls. Given the phoenix palms planted up by the beach houses, each and every one was tall. It felt like visiting southern lands. <laughs> I love this written sound effects. <laughs> As if she had just gotten out of a bath, Yuka had her hand on her hip and gulped it down uh, gulped down the can of coffee in one go. She was always decked out in frills, but what shows through occasionally was Yuka's true personality. Did she like drinking coffee? What? And then while holding our cans of coffee, we walked on the beach before us. You know, I know this is in Japan because I feel like if this was in the US, the beach would be filled! Himeko, you know this place. Uh, yeah, well, I don't know where to go. Yes? Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm saying. Just, just wait a minute. Why do you know you don't know the car you're driving? Ah, actually, I'm just driving on the street.偶然たどり着いただけだったりして、それってもしかしてさ、今まで気の向くままに走ってただけってこと？まあそんな感じかな。信じらんない。つかちゃんと家まで帰れるかも心配だけど、こんなドライブに一日付き合わされた私も信じ
だってさ何が悲しくて毎週毎週女二人でドライブばっかなのよ No? What? だってこれ二人乗りなんだもんそういう問題じゃないでしょまあまあ寂しい問答しってことで<笑>悔しいけど反論できないわ See, now I'm changing my mind. Is Yuka actually just like looking straight up like a mate, like a Lolita sort of outfit with like frills and like curled hair instead of just having long beige hair? Hmm. Around when the sun had been、uh, so high, was hazing over the over, and everything that could be seen was dyed orange. Oh, that's a common phrase they like using dyed orange. Once again, the Yuno s drove on. We had played at the beach and now took up a quick route home. Today had been a fun day. While thinking that, I gripped the wheel. <laughs> 最近あなたって全然行ってないでしょ教会。What's the problem with not going to church every week? ちひろちゃんもぼやいてたわよ。最近お姉ちゃんが全然来てくれないって。ねえ、たまには顔出したら ?Okay, sure, once in a while, sure. で、大丈夫よ。I just like to think this is like, uh, Himeko just not believe in God anymore. それにそれでしょ所詮私はエセカトリックだって。だから大丈夫なのよ。姫子。さてそんなわけで来週もドライブ決定ね。あ,あ、今度はお弁当も持ってこようか。そんで今日よりも遠くを目指してみましょうよ。That's such a waste of gas. <laughs> はいはい、わかったわよ。しょうがないから付き合ってあげる。ありがとう。さすが親友。Yikes! I'm waiting for Himiko to be like, you're gonna go to the seventh floor, or she's gonna go to the seventh floor. I'm waiting for Himiko to be like, you're gonna go to the seventh floor, or she's gonna go to the seventh floor. I'm waiting for Himiko to be like, you're gonna go to the seventh floor, or she's gonna go to the seventh floor. I'm waiting for Himiko to be like, you're gonna go to the seventh floor, or she's gonna go to the seventh floor. I'm waiting for Himiko to be like, you're gonna go to the seventh floor, or she's gonna go to the seventh floor. I'm waiting for Himiko to be like, you're gonna go to the seventh floor, or she's gonna go to the seventh floor. I'm waiting for Himiko to be like, you're gonna go to the seventh floor, or she's gonna go to the seventh floor. I'm waiting for Himiko to be like, you're gonna go to the seventh floor, or she's gonna go to the seventh floor. I'm waiting for Himiko to be like, <laughs> Two people came to visit me. Nothing needed to be said about Shahira, but even looking like this, Yuka had been the first to rush over. Nothing need to be said about Chihiro, but even looking like this, Yuka had been the first to rush over. Even before, when I'd be in bed with a cold, complaining all the while, she'd be at my side taking care of me. She wasn't the most true to herself, but really was very kind. That was my best friend. Oh, it's good! It's good! 別にいいじゃない。いっぱいあるんだし。うーん。でもさ、いきなり入院って聞いた時は驚いたわよ。うん。私もびっくりした。なのに、急いで駆けつけてみたら、ピンピンしてて、拍子抜けよね。こら、あんたが言わないでよ。<笑>だってみんなそんな顔してるんだもん。そういえば、千尋ちゃん。他の人は
I don't understand. Why is she in the hospital? Like, did the- I don't- Am I just imposing? Like, did the, she say she was on 7th floor? Or is it just like, oh no, I like broke my leg and now I'm here? ちなみにデブラで見舞いに来たのはあなただけよ。うるさいわね。変な本買ってきてあげたでしょうが。あれはちゃんと代金渡したからお使いであってお見舞いの差し入れとは言えないわね。相変わらずヘリクツを。でも